hi guys good morning for today's video we're going to have a tutorial I'm going to teach you how to manually use an automatic washing machine and this washing machine of mine I bought this about almost three years almost three years ago it will finish its three years by February 21 and I have benefited much of this washing machine and so we're going to start our tutorial video using this automatic washing machine to manually use this machine so here's my laundry dirty uniforms and I have placed some water uh, uh, it's like uh, it's not yet enough so we're going to put some water water manually so if there's nearby faucet like this so you can fill in your tub with some water open the faucet and there it is the water that's filling your washing machine tub so until the level that you need so you, you'll wait for some time if it seems that the water level is enough for you so you check so water is already up to here and to wash this dirty uniforms it's like uh, it seems that it's enough to wash with liquid soap this dirty uniform so you'll stop the source of water you remove this faucet and you have to close it but before you will close it here's the area uh, now it's dirty <laughs> but it's okay now you can place your amount of liquid soap in here okay then you close it then the ex the container where you place your liquid soap you can rinse it here so you can take all the liquid soap that you want to use so from there now we are going to close the washing machine so here it is and so we're going to switch on this this on area so it will show you the eight minutes two times five minutes and it shows show you the condensed bubble yes so you're now going to use it manually so what you're going to do is you will just mm, choose this eight minutes you, you have to close these two choices so it will not uh, finish it until the end or drain because later you may want it to repeat the cycle of eight minutes but for me my first cycle I want to do it as 12 minutes so I will uh, push this button wash so you uh, switching off the, the two choices and then some more push then you'll go to the 12 minutes now with this 12 minutes you're going to push the start button so from there you started on the uh, start button so we fill the tub with only about uh, some water so if with this 77 liters it will not work 
So what you're going to do is push the button of water level until you reach this 21 liters. I will just show you that it will reach that level. It will reach this level as well and, and the highest one. But we're wanting the lowest level of water. So from there, you can hear the washing machine working because the water level is at, it is is at its uh, least level. So that will do 21 liters. So you have started and you're running your washing machine for, for 12 minutes. And there it shows the 12 minutes. Now you just wait for that 12 minutes to finish and it will stop automatically because you did you switch off these two choices so after 12 minutes if you want to repeat it we can do it as you like so we'll we'll just uh, wait for some time and i'll show you until this 12 minutes finish so i'll come back again for this video thank you Hi guys, I'm back. Now the washing machine is in on its one minute level. So this is about to finish. We'll just wait. And this will stop automatically. So there it is. It is on the zero minutes. So which means that the washing machine stops and you can open your tub and your washing machine is on its wash wash level that if you can check that your soap is not that enough you can add some more and you will just continue the cycle so again you have to push the bottom after adding some more detergents or liquid soap by this tab this on part push it and then you choose either 12 or 8 minutes whatever you wish but for me it's like i'm going to choose now 8 minutes so i'm going to start but then before starting because if in case that you're gonna repeat again the cycle, you have to switch this, both buttons. But for me, I'm not going to repeat it anymore. After 12 minutes, then 8 minutes, I'm going to finish it like this. From 8 minutes, so it will go to 2 times. So from the before the second time, it will drain your water. So that will finish, it will drain, it will dry, and then you will add some water for rinsing after that happens. Okay, let's do it. We'll push the bottom of start to have another 8 minute cycle. So there it is. It again showed you 77 liters, but this will stop. As you can not hear now, the machine is not running. So you'll choose again the... 21 liters the least level so there it is there it's working now it showed you 37 or 30 from 38 to 37 minutes because you didn't switch off this two buttons i didn't switch off because i want to finish this washing off of my uniform as fast as it could so it, after this 8 minutes, it will drain down to 5 minutes. It will drain all the water with the soap. And I can add again water for rinsing. So that's it, guys. If you want to see, I will I will finish it later. Then we'll co I'll come back for this video again. I'm back for this video. And for this, it goes all the way down to 2 times then to five minutes but while it will it will uh, go to five minutes and i will show you now that there's that water draining from its uh, the drain water drain 
So until that water finished, then it will drain your clothes. And from that, that uh, you cannot open. Or, yeah, you can open it. And it is draining the water. You can open for as long as there's no light in the sealed black. If it's uh, close, the light is closed just as like this. There is the light. So you can open your tab. And then you can cover it again for you to finish the cycle. Until it finish the water draining from there. It will dry up your uh, laundry. That's it. I'll show you again later. Hi guys, I'm back. And here, uh, you finish the draining of water. There, stop the draining of water. And from here, you cannot open the lid because there's the light showing. But you will just push on the bottom, start or hold. You will just hold it like this. And it will uh, switch off the light from this lid lock button. So you can now open the tap and get the source of the water and add some water for rinsing. Now you can switch on the water source. And there it is. Filling your tub with some water. Then you just wait for some time until what level you may want. Then you will just switch off the source of water and we'll cover the tub and we will push on the start button to start again for the rinsing. Now, uh, uh, while filling it up, you can just uh, switch off your top for the meantime and we'll wait for some time until the level that you want is reached. So we'll switch off, then uh, it's not wasting any energy. So that's it guys. Uh, I'm gonna be back again to finish the rinsing uh, cycle. And I'll show you. I'm back guys. So as you can see, the water level, level is up to here. So you can stop the water source. Remove this faucet. And you can start again for rinsing. So push the on button. And then... You can see this, uh, you'll just start on here because you need not to switch off this both buttons. You'll have to push the start and now it is working with the 77 liters but it may stop because it is not, uh, we, didn't, we didn't reach the full level actually so it stops from running so we'll choose again the water water level here this so the this level may do maybe so we'll start oh no need to start because it's now working because the level of this water is just enough we feed it up up to that level maybe so it now it's working so we'll wait until it finishes drain and dry your laundry so there it is we'll wait for some time until it will finish again the first cycle of rinsing your laundry so i'll back again guys see you later and the first cycle of rinsing is done so we're just going to push the hold button and it will close the light for the lid lock so you you can open and now it's dry and then you'll add some wa water again for the second cycle of rinsing and there it is filling up your water and uh, your tub again with some water if you wanted to have the second cycle you can fill it up to whatever you may want
but for me I'm just gonna fill it uh, the this devil because I'm going to add some uh, fabric conditioner in this uh, area so I will finish my laundry so I'll wait for some time and I'll be back again I'm back guys so I fill up the tub to that level of water so we're gonna close the water source then we can uh, place direct the fabric conditioner or we can place in this area so we're just gonna rinse the container of our fabric conditioner and we'll just cover and push the on button and we'll have to uh, push the start button and again the water level so it will run and that's it guys until it finishes drain and dry your laundry and that's the end of they're washing manually using the automatic washing machine thanks for watching guys until this ends so i can place it on the separate dryer and there it is after drying it up i'm just gonna fold it and keep in my closet thank you guys for watching we're on the last cycle the fabric conditioner using the fabric conditioner so thank you guys for watching please subscribe to my channel if you're new to this video click on the bell button of notification to notify you of all my upcoming videos thank you guys for watching bye bye